In a world striving for equality and inclusivity, it's essential to examine the language we use and the impact it can have on others. While conversations around sensitivity and respect often revolve around women's experiences, it's equally important to address the ways in which men can be affected by harmful statements. According to psychology, there are certain phrases that can deeply wound a man's emotions and perpetuate harmful stereotypes. By shedding light on these 15 things you should never say to a man, we can foster healthier conversations, cultivate understanding, and create an environment that values the diverse experiences and emotions of all individuals. So, let's embark on a journey to challenge stereotypes, break the silence, and foster empathy as we explore the impact of our words on the well-being of men. Let's get started with the things you should never say to a man. 1. You're such a loser or any derogatory insults. Insulting someone's character or worth is deeply damaging and can erode their self-esteem. It's crucial to treat others with kindness and respect, fostering a positive and supportive environment for everyone. 2. You're not a good provider. Linking a man's worth solely to his ability to provide financially is demeaning and dismisses other valuable qualities they possess. It's essential to recognize that individuals contribute in various ways to relationships, families, and society as a whole. Valuing diverse contributions promotes equality and mutual respect. 3. You're not attractive enough. Criticizing someone's physical appearance is hurtful and can deeply affect their self-esteem. It's essential to promote body positivity and focus on inner qualities rather than solely external appearance. 4. Man up or be a real man. These phrases often imply that men should suppress their emotions, be tough, and avoid vulnerability. But this doesn't mean that you should be weak, but you should be able to express your feelings as man without being judged. Such expectations can be harmful because men, like anyone else, have a wide range of emotions and should feel comfortable expressing them. Encouraging emotional openness and acceptance can contribute to healthier relationships and improved mental well-being. 5. You throw like a girl or any derogatory comparisons to women. These comments perpetuate gender stereotypes by suggesting that being feminine or resembling a woman is inherently weak or inferior, they reinforce harmful notions of gender roles and can be hurtful to both men and women. It's important to promote equality and respect by avoiding derogatory comparisons based on gender. 6. You're not as successful as that person or that friend of yours. Making comparisons to others in terms of success can be damaging to someone's self-esteem and overall well-being. Each person's journey is unique, and success should be defined individually rather than by external standards. Encouraging personal growth and celebrating individual accomplishments is more supportive and positive. 7. You're just like your father. This statement can evoke negative associations or imply that the person is destined to repeat their father's mistakes or negative traits. It may bring up unresolved issues or family conflicts. It's important to address individuals as separate entities and not assume their behavior will mirror their parents. 8. You're too sensitive or you're overreacting. Dismissing someone's emotions or reactions can invalidate their feelings and create barriers to open communication. Men, like anyone else, have a right to express their emotions without judgment or ridicule. Encouraging emotional intelligence and understanding can foster healthier relationships. This is also a form of gaslighting which is associated with dark psychology and manipulation. 9. Why can't you be more like that person? This statement implies that the person should change their personality or behavior to meet someone else's expectations. It disregards individuality and can be demoralizing. It's important to accept people for who they are and appreciate their unique qualities. 10. You're not a real man if you can't handle this situation. Similar to man up, this statement puts pressure on men to suppress vulnerability and cope with situations in a specific way. It can contribute to toxic masculinity and discourage seeking help or expressing emotional distress. Encouraging open conversations about mental health and support seeking is crucial for overall well-being. 11. Are you sure you can handle that? Doubting someone's abilities based on their gender is patronizing and demeaning. It reinforces stereotypes and implies that men are less capable than women in certain areas. Treating individuals with respect and assuming their competence promotes a positive and inclusive environment. 12. 
you're such a player, or all men are the same. Making generalizations about men or any gender group oversimplifies their complexities and undermines their individuality. It's important to recognize that people are unique, and making sweeping statements can perpetuate harmful stereotypes and hinder understanding and connection. 13. You're just a stay-at-home dad? Disregarding or belittling men's choices regarding their careers or family roles is disrespectful. Men, like women, should have the freedom to choose their desired roles without judgment. Valuing and respecting diverse family arrangements is important for building inclusive and supportive communities. 14. Real men don't cry. Expecting men to suppress their emotions reinforces harmful stereotypes and inhibits healthy emotional expression. Allowing men to express their emotions, including sadness and vulnerability, fosters emotional well-being and more meaningful connections. 15. You're too weak or you're not strong enough. These statements can undermine a man's self-confidence and reinforce unrealistic expectations of physical strength. Strength should be recognized in different forms, including emotional, mental, and interpersonal strength. Encouraging a broader definition of strength can promote healthier self-perceptions. This statement also touch on the most sensitive side of men which is pride. In our quest for empathy and understanding, it's crucial to recognize that harmful statements can affect anyone, regardless of gender. By being mindful of the words we choose, we can contribute to a more inclusive and supportive society. Remember, every individual is unique, with their own emotions, experiences, and vulnerabilities. By avoiding damaging stereotypes, encouraging open communication, and treating each other with respect, we can create an environment where everyone feels valued and heard. Let's continue the journey towards breaking down harmful norms, fostering empathy, and building stronger connections that celebrate the diverse range of emotions and experiences in all individuals. Together, we can create a world where everyone feels safe, respected, and understood. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please hit that like button, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this one.